488 miles. Is that the bottom line of the problem? I can't say that's the bottom line of the problem. I can give examples. If you look at the other municipalities in our area, let's just use Daphne for example. And if I'm getting off somewhere, I should. No, just let me no, know. That's okay. And I've got <laughs> something I'm going to follow up with that. Go ahead, Fred. You know, it, if you look at Daphne, for example, and not to compare us with Daphne or compare Daphne with us, just police size. You know, average patrol shift for us, for the Fairhope Police Department, is four officers. And that's hoping somebody's not sick, hoping somebody's not in school, hoping, you know, four, best case, four. Daphne, 12. In the so sheriff's the department, yes. 15. So is the answer yes? I would love to see more right, officers. Let me ask you another question. Let, let, me, let me, are you, you got another question? I got one yes, more. Yes, sir. I, I would, uh, it's, it's obvious that's the problem. So when we talk about tip lines, we talk about all these other really good measures, but out of 100% deterrence, uh, would more manpower uh, be a 90% uh, deterrence and everything else we've talked about, the tip line and everything else, be 10%? Would that be? I, I would be Ma maybe I'm not on the point. Lines, but yes, more but manpower, point. more police out on the streets, more right. investigators sharing the caseloads, more boots on the ground in the captain's division. Right. You know, it, it, to where if we had, and I'll just throw a number, and this, this is just Fred King throwing a number. Right. If we had eight officers patrolling, you four, and once again, this is just me making an arbitrary split, you four are south of 104, you four are north of 104. Mm -hmm. If I had four guys riding around for 12 hours north of 104 in Fair Oaks jurisdiction, then we would have, probably for Mr. McGriff, I would have a much better idea, yes, somebody came through your neighborhood once every 20 minutes. Yeah. You know, it just, and we spoke of saturation, I think, earlier. And it would be easier to saturate an area if you had more bodies. 20 minutes till late. I know it's real crowded in here. Let's take a few more questions, and then uh, I'll take a motion that we adjourn if I can get someone to do that. I just, yes, sir. I just have one. I just want to understand. Are you telling me that any given time during the day, there's four police officers patrolling the streets of Fairhope? Yes, sir. That's right all now in the whole city. And they're 12. And some, and well, at some time we have five because I have an officer that comes out from two. And you're telling me Daphne has 12? Yes, sir. We have a canine officer that comes out from two to two. We have two canine officers. They, they, they come in from two to two. So they'll all get those shifts at, at peak hours. How many people live in Fairhope? 17 five. How many people live in Daphne? Uh, 20, 22, 22, 25, isn't it? And they have twice as many or more. They have a much larger. Yeah. 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 Yeah.